A new poll shows Donald Trump is gaining more ground in the presidential race. The CNN survey out this morning shows he trails Hillary Clinton by just six points. That margin was 16 points just a month ago. The poll also shows a majority of American voters, 53 percent, now have an unfavorable view of Clinton. The Democratic frontrunner will... Tuesday about the private email server she used as Secretary of State, and she did not back down. Nancy Cordes is in Washington with Clinton's very firm response. Nancy, good morning. Good morning. Yes, it really was a departure from what we've heard from Clinton in recent weeks when she either stuck to short generic answers about this or tried to make light of it. This time she got animated, defended her actions, but there was still one sensitive aspect of all this she avoided. What I did was legally permitted. In a Vegas gymnasium, Clinton First said she's being okay. singled out unfairly. You know, I get a lot of attention because I had uh, a personal email account, as did other high-ranking officials. Uh, she shrugged the off the fact that intelligence work. officials now say some of those emails should have been marked classified and transmitted via a secure government system. What you're seeing now is a disagreement between agencies saying, you know what, they should have, and the other saying, no, they shouldn't. That has nothing to do with me. Everybody's acting like this is the first time it's ever happened. It happens all the time. But the FBI doesn't ask for people's servers all the time. You tried to wipe the whole server. You didn't I, I'm, I'm not, you know, I don't, I have no idea. That's why we turned it over. You, we, you were in charge of it. You were the official in charge. Did you wipe the server? What, like with a cloth or something? I don't know. You know how it works digitally. Did you try to I, write the whole thing? I don't know how it works digitally at all. The controversy does not appear to have shaken her staunchest supporters. CBS News spoke to more than a dozen Hillblazers, donors who have raised $100,000 or more. They're not worried about these issues. What Dallas lawyer about Regina about Montoya and all the others said they aren't worried about the email flap or even paying much attention to it. I can't tell you, even just today, I received a phone call or I spoke to someone who said, when is the next event for Hillary? Clinton's approval ratings among Democrats were still sky high in the latest CBS News poll. That's Democratic strategist Steve McMahon. And so far there's no this has hurt her in the primary other than the fact that she hasn't completely solidified 100% of the vote, which was never really possible anyway. Even Clinton, as she left Thank the press conference, Thank said it's reporters, not Democratic voters, who care about the emails most. Nobody talks to me about it other than you guys. It's true that the issue has not come up at any town hall we've seen where Clinton takes questions from dozens of voters. But some donors have expressed concern that where this controversy could hurt her is in the general election, when she has to win over not just Democrats, but the entire country, Gail. All right, Nancy, thank you.